New Farm is heaving a collective sigh of relief. It could have been much worse in this suburb. It was much worse in other suburbs. And we know it was incredibly bad in places like Lockyer Valley. So that's why the money that we raise today is going to the Premier's disaster appeal. This is a tremendous community and when you have an event like this, there is a silver lining, an opportunity to build community. It's not just about recovery, uh, it's about a restoration of that sense of community. So we say collectively, in one voice, we are on the way back, we're going to be bigger and better than we were before. so much for all those people who had inundation and flood um, in their house and around their neighbourhood. We lost power, but I think together as a community we did a fantastic job. What a feeling you get as a local member when you're out in the streets and you see all these people out there helping. And as Michael, my husband, said, um, and he's in the audience, he said, it's like seagulls fighting over a chip out there. You know, somebody put something out and we're all fighting to pick it up and put it in the truck. Amazing community spirit makes you feel very proud and makes you feel so proud not only to be a Queenslander but to be a resident of this fantastic community. Today is about showing our concern, our empathy, um, our plans for assisting local residents and businesses rebuild their lives, their businesses and look forward. Um, as I, I speak often about the wonderful community spirit in New Farm and having grown up here and lived here for a long time for most of my life, uh, that community spirit was evident just a few weeks ago. And I know that we're going to be here today to build a much more healthier and much more vibrant Brisbane. It's a wonderful time to be a new farmer. We share, we work together and we build for the future. The last few weeks have seen that spirit at work and today we know. We want to say thank you to everyone and that's what we're doing, taking a moment to stop, to share, to take stock and to get ready for what we have to do next.